Welcome back to Berry Brook and thank you everybody for watching so far. Here today I have a 4-4. Now this is a four-seater, so you don't tend to see too many of these. Uh, this is a 2003 model in Chrysler Steel Blue. Look at it there, you've got the chrome bumper, you've also got the chrome grille on there. You've also got 15 inch wire wheels. Look at those, aren't they lovely? As we move round the side, you can see you've got tread rubbers, you've got an aerial because this car does have a CD radio cassette and look at that interior, it is lovely. On the rear, you've got a luggage rack and now that's a larger luggage rack, so it's enough for two people. There's also full size spare with a wire wheel on there as well. So this 4.4 has a blue mohair hood, it does have side screens, but uh, they're in my office at the moment. Inside then, this is the rear, so two people can fit in there. Uh, I'll talk about the rear a little bit more, easy to fold down look. And in the back storage compartment, you've got tonneau cover uh, in there, which obviously really, really helpful also a side screen bag. Under the bonnet, you've got the 1.8 Ford ZTEC engine. Uh, this is coupled with a five speed gearbox as well. Inside then, you've also got a, a walnut dash. This particular car's also got under 30,000 miles. So it is 20 years old, so 3,000 miles a year. Shall we go for a drive? Now with the four seaters, the seat belt uh, is on the other side, so it's on the left hand side. So you just need to remember to put that on before you go anywhere, folks, don't forget. So today we're going to go right, we're going to go uh, through the back end of uh, Exminster, because uh, there's some nice winding roads down there. So I did mention this car has a 1.8 Ford ZTEC engine, 16 valve version. It's got about 111 brake horsepower, which is ample for a car that weighs way under a ton. Now we're gonna get out of the village. We're gonna have a, a little go through some of those lovely winding roads. Let's go. Now this car handles particularly well. Uh, this car was bought from Life Motors, has only got one previous owner. Now Life Motors were the eldest Morgan dealer in the country, uh, no longer running, uh, unfortunately. They do have an amazing legacy. So as I mentioned, this car handles particularly well, even in these uh, country lanes. Uh, it's nippy, uh, it turns in really, really well. I really, really enjoyed driving this car. So the hood, uh, the hood does take a few minutes to get up. I prefer driving this car without the hood and the side screens. Uh, the tonneau cover obviously would make a massive difference. It comes with the car, which is great. So for stopping, this car's got calipers on the front and drum brakes on the rear. Uh, say for these winding roads, it's ample to stop this light little car. It does feel really agile uh, zooming down these uh, little lanes. So this video was shot in October 2023. We actually had a really nice day to do this uh, video. Again, it was a pleasure. So even with the side screens off and the wind rushing through or over my bald head, uh, it was uh, actually a pleasure to drive. It really was um, not a huge amount of noise coming from the car. Uh, again, just a great fun zipping around. Well worth booking in a test drive with me. So again, this car pretty quick off the mark, 0 to 60. Well, actually it's a Morgan. We don't really talk 0 to 60. It just gets you going really quickly.
Now part of owning a Morgan is uh, stopping and speaking with people. People will want to stop and talk to you regardless of whether you want to stop or not. Uh, they are a very unique looking car. Uh, you get a huge uh, amount of interest on these um, little cars, uh, which is nice. It's hard to be inconspicuous, uh, but you do get a lot of waves. Uh, that's one thing I have noticed uh, driving around uh, the lanes when you do bump into people. You do get uh, the odd wave, which is nice. Uh, a nice smile on the face. Let's face it, these cars uh, always put you in a good mood. Uh, just a fantastic driver's car. People love to see them because it's not the kind of car that you see on the road every day. So again, be prepared to get those uh, waves, get some conversations going with people. You know, it's great to talk to people. Oh look, here comes someone now. Oh, hey. So let's get back to uh, the office now. So we're going back in uh, to Exminster from the way we came. It would be lovely to see this car go to a nice home. Uh, just because it's got four seats doesn't mean it's uh, not very good. It is extremely practical. Those extra seats, you can have people in there, you can have furry animals or luggage. If you do want to book a test drive, give me a ring, email me or pop in and see me. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.